Hey everyone, Zeta Hell Secrets here. Today, I just want to talk to you guys about some possible new key art, helmets, and coatings coming to Halo Infinite in Season 3. So, the first thing I want to touch on is possible new key art. Now, this looks awesome. So, I'll throw a picture of it up on screen now. And basically, down the bottom, we have the two new maps coming to Halo Infinite called Oasis and Cliffhanger. And then in the background, we've got like this massive like forerunner structure that's got like this beam going into the sky and ground. And honestly, this is my computer background when it comes out. Like, honestly, this is probably my favorite key art that Halo Infinite has showed off and released. Like, it's, it's awesome. And the second thing I wanted to touch on is new helmets for the Mark VII core. So the first helmet is this kind of like... EVA and kind of Zvezda looking helmet, but it's got more like padding and it kind of gives off like a juggernaut kind of vibe. And honestly, I would wear this helmet. Like, it looks so good. The next helmet is p possibly even better. So it basically looks like the Mark IV helmet, but it's got like, or it reminds me of kind of like George's helmet from Halo Reach. Like, it's got like kind of padding. Or like little squares of padding near the ears and kind of got more like out outset little breathing compartments and dude it it looks so good and the next one security now I'm not the biggest fan of security to begin with and I know everyone's gonna unsubscribe and hate me for that but I think this security looks really good so Maybe I'll start to like security a bit more because, honestly, every helmet that has come over from other games to Infinite has looked actually pretty decent. So I'm hopeful for security and I'm sure it would look really good in game. Now, the next one is actually pretty cool and I think I will probably wear it. It basically looks like GRD from Halo Reach except it doesn't have any attachments. And I know we've already gotten like a basically GRD in a form of a Rakshasha helmet, but this one looks really good. And as I said, probably gonna use it. Like honestly, the next one is even more surprising for me because I don't actually usually like this helmet. So the next helmet Basically just looks like Deadeye from Halo 4, which is kind of really cool because I don't usually like Deadeye, but I really like this helmet. <laughs> so you can imagine they bring over other Halo 4 helmets, which are kind of a bit stingy sometimes. They'll probably look good because I love the design of this and I think it looks awesome. And especially paired with some of the new cross-core coatings that got leaked by ISO. Mark 5B and Uri are getting Scorpion Punch, which is pretty cool because they look awesome on those cores. And SBI, it's going to have 61 plus coatings. Yeah, 61. That's, I think, possibly more than Mark 5B. Like, that's a lot. And there's tons of cool ones here. Like, there's a foresty kind of camo one there's a uh, gray silver black and yellow coating with like these cool like circuit board little patterns on it and that looks so good and dude from what we've seen Halo Infinite season three is probably going to be one of the best seasons like they're also changing red shift so it has more of a battered look because before, it looked like it had been through, like, 15 car washes in a row. It was so comically clean. So now they're going to kind of, like, um, batter it up and it's got more scratches and dents, which actually looks really good. So, honestly, I think Halo Infinite Season 3 will probably bring back a good couple, maybe thousand people to the game because, dude, it's looking so good right now. I just want to say most of the footage and screenshots that you see in the video were from the Delta Index Discord server and ISO's channel, so I'll link both of those down in the description.